So stents are placed in the arteries that supply the heart. When heart stents came on the scene, they expanded on the effectiveness of angioplasty procedures used to open blocked arteries. A stent was developed to minimize the chance of a blockage coming back at the site of an angioplasty. With a traditional angioplasty, the risk of a block recurring at the same site could be as high as 30 to 40 percent. Using a stent bettered the odds. With a stent to keep the blockage open and the plaque propped out of the way, the chance of blockage coming back is reduced to somewhere in the range of 10 to 15 percent with our older stents. The old school stents are made of a bare metal material, but today patients have new options. The next generation of stents are called drug coated or drug eluding stents. They're coated with a material and a medication that keeps the body from forming excess scar tissue where the stent is. And with these type of stents, our risk of blockage coming back is now down to about 5%. Medicated stents require doctors to prescribe anti-clotting drugs. For the newer drug-coated stents, we need to use blood thinners at least a year and I actually use it for several years after one of those stents is placed. As technology advances, researchers are constantly looking for safer, better ways to mend broken hearts. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.